What's up guys, it's Alfred and I'm back with another video. So for today's video guys, I'm gonna be doing another hair vlog. I haven't done like an official hair vlog on my channel in like a minute. So for today's video guys, I'm gonna be trying something that I seen on YouTube like a while ago. It's basically a new technique to bleach your hair and it's called a bleach bath. So I'm gonna be trying that for today's video because honestly y'all, bleaching hair takes up so much fucking time when you have to do it strip by strip and you got the faux, the aluminum foil everywhere. It's just a lot. So if this bleach bath situation actually works guess who's gonna be doing this from now on this motherfucker right here any technique that I try on my channel and I find that it actually works I'm gonna actually start putting it in my fucking routine like in my other video when I tried to curl my hair using a water bottle that shit really did not fucking work but if it would have worked guess who would have been using a water bottle to curl their motherfucking hair bitch me so thank you to Nate Beauty for sending me their 150 density lace frontal unit this is the wig that I'm gonna be demoing for you all today so we can actually see if this bleach bath situation is a quicker solution to bleaching your hair or if it's just another hassle. You're going for like a cool, a very, very, very coolly ashy toned dark blonde. I don't know if it's gonna work in this situation, but if it does work, that is the look that I'm going for for today. But if it doesn't work, then we'll be going for another look, bitch. If this is your first time seeing my face, hello, my name is Alfred, nice to meet you. And if you're returning, welcome back, bitch. You already know I missed you. If new and returning, before you all leave, do not forget to hit that bell button down below to be notified every time a bitch posts a video. And Shadow, you can't be doing that. Uh-uh, he up here trying to grab on this thing while I'm filming. So if you don't already, don't forget to follow me on my Instagram and Twitter. They are both Alfred Lewis the third. And without further ado, let's just hop right on into the video. Okay, y'all, starting off, I have a bucket. This is just the regular bucket that I use to go ahead and um, watercolor my units or whatever. And I have some bleach, some quick blue extra strength bleach. I have some developer. This is the Clairol 40 volume developer. And then if I run out of that, because I don't really have a lot of that, I need to go to the beauty supply store, bitch. I have a little bit of this 50 volume developer, but it's like barely anything in here. So I don't even know why I just showed y'all this. Look at that. Girl, that ain't gonna do shit. So, yeah, I only have this 40 volume developer, so let's hope this fills up the bucket. I have like a decent little amount in here, so yeah, let's go. I only have one glove, so that's fine. So I'm just gonna hold it with one hand so I could protect everything. I feel like this is gonna be messy and I don't know. <laughs> I really do feel like it's gonna be messy, y'all, and this is gonna be a big old mess, but let's see. First scoop. I'm gonna do three scoops, just cause I wanna actually coat the hair. She put a lot. Ooh, ooh, that's a lot. Ooh, my nose. I kinda wanna just take my hand and like stir it up in there. I don't know. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. I should never use my hand. Now, I'm stupid. <laughs> I really wanna see if this works so you and me can have a better alternative to bleaching wigs. So if you bleach wigs out there, you already know the hassle with that shit. And then the fumes be getting in your face and then the bleach be getting all over the floor. And then don't let it get on your hand. Your hand start turning white. It's, it's just too much. Now I'm just gonna dip her in. Basically, I just like dipped it in there. So, one mistake that I did is I used a big ass bucket, so I can't really go in how I want to if this was like a flat bucket. So that's one mistake, but I mean, that's my stupid ass fault. If you plan to do this, use like a, <coughs> oh my God, these heels. Use a, like a flat rectangular bucket. I would say is the downfall to this 
is that you don't get like a precise like application for the bleach like at the top the top you see like right here I got a piece right there so that's gonna be blind but I didn't want to take the bleach all the way up there I just wanted the ends I guess I'm just gonna hang it off like that and just start putting her on the legs Now I'm done putting the bleach on the knots. This was honestly quicker. This was way quicker. I like this. The only thing is it gets really messy up here. Like as y'all can see the frontal is like really messy. If you were just doing like bundles or something like that, bitch, I would say do this. If you had to bleach like a whole bunch of bundles and you didn't feel like splitting them and everything, this is definitely, definitely, definitely a uh, alternative to bleaching your bundles quicker. But the only other thing is that you have to make sure that you go actually inside of the hair because as you can see in the middle of the hair is still black. But on the outside is blind and everything. I don't really mind. Just keep that in mind if you plan on doing this. Make sure to use a comb or a brush to actually get everything in. I'm just gonna go ahead and let this sit and I'll be right back. All right y'all, so it is now like 30 minutes later and I went ahead and let it sit. So now I'm gonna go ahead and wash it out and tone the hair and I'm just gonna prop y'all up so y'all can watch me do that real quick. So yeah, let's actually see how the bleaching turned out and, and if it looks like I just slapped some bleach on that motherfucker or it actually looks like I actually took my time and it looks like a good cohesive bleached wig. Let's find out. <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and take my Shimmer Life Shampoo to go ahead and tone the hair real quick. So I want some steaming, steaming hot water, y'all. So I'm gonna go ahead and fill my bucket up in the kitchen sink with hot water because that water is like way more hotter. Okay y'all, so now that I have this sitting in the shampoo, I'm just gonna let it sit for a little bit so it can take some of the orangey tones out of the hair. So it didn't really bleach that light, but that could be because I didn't have enough bleach or it could be because I didn't leave it in there for long enough. Or it could be because my developer wasn't high enough. So it could be all of those things, but I mean, for the first time and like I said already I do enjoy it I will recommend it definitely for bundles of hair if you're dying some bundles of hair you need to be doing this method you do not need to be doing it by hand if you can just put them in a bucket and just swirl it around and comb it and swirl it but for wigs if you want to be like very detailed and precise I wouldn't recommend doing this because it is a big ass just bucket of bleach and you're just putting it like everywhere but if you want to do something quick and easy like an ombre effect or if you want to just dye the whole entire wig itself, I'm definitely sure you could just put it in a bucket and with a whole bunch of bleach and just swish that shit around and bitch, I'm pretty sure you'll have a 613 wig. Don't forget to check out Nate Beauty Hair. I really do enjoy the quality of the hair and the knots on this wig are very, very, very small. Y'all already know. Y'all already know how I feel about that. All right, y'all, so now I'm just gonna go ahead and install the unit really quickly. I'm, I'm gonna install it using my Got To Be Freeze Blasting Spray like always.
All right, y'all, so now that I am done installing the wig, I'm just putting it in a part right now with some of my foundation. All right, y'all, so this is the completed hair. And I honestly am living for this. It's like a natural, a very, very, very natural ombre. And I'm not mad at it. I am not mad at it. If you all enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up before you all leave. And don't forget to check out Nay Beauty Hair. And if you do decide to purchase something, just use my code down below to save some money off. I got y'all. I love you all so, so, so fucking much. And I will see you all in my next video. Bye.